a breakthrough deal to end school furloughs. It took the state's director of business and Hawaii bankers to break furlough Friday log jam. KITV 4's Catherine Cruz begins our team coverage. Catherine. Well, the governor gives credit to Ted Liu, the head of the Department of Business and Economic Development, for tapping the local banks to help close a $10 million state budget shortfall. Bottom line is the furloughs are over. Tomorrow. The announcement brought smiles to a crowd of lawmakers, teachers, and parents. We're just absolutely thrilled that it's over. Um, I brought the kids here so that they could see that uh, grown-ups can fix problems, bad problems that they create. Under this latest deal, the governor will release $57 million from the Hurricane Relief Fund to help eliminate the furlough Fridays in DOE schools. Ling will add $2.2 in federal funds to specifically help charter schools. And public school teachers will give up six of their planning days so students can stay in the classroom. The surprise piece of the puzzle is the state will be able to tap a $10 million interest-free line of credit provided by local banks if the DOE needs the money to get through the school year. Why? Because it's the right thing to do. Uh, I think all of us put the children first, which frankly has not been the case probably over the last several months. While the $10 million credit sounds great, there is a restriction on how it can be used. It can't be to directly pay salaries. So that's really the one distinction that has to be met. Details about if the money will cover furloughs of all school workers covered under HGA and UPW is still unclear. But the acting superintendent of schools did say this. The $57 million that the governor is releasing will go towards the, the furlough days, um, the, with salaries, the expenses of operating the school, um, the teachers, the principals, everyone else that's involved in uh, keeping us uh, operating. And so that's the first priority. Now, by the way, we did ask the governor if she had any plans for a pardon for those parents who were arrested during the furlough Friday protest. She said no, but some parents are heading to a bar tonight to talk about using the momentum to keeping the focus on improving public education. Kiyoki Kerr will have that story coming up later on in our newscast. Reporting live, Catherine Cruz, KITV4 News.